Hey everyone, it's Bob McCraney with Texas Pride Realty and I just want to make a quick video. Um, today we won a, I think, a real victory for our buyers and our sellers. And we're thankful to the folks at Republic Title for being responsive and helping us with this. Uh, basically, when you buy or sell a home in Texas, there is a, a survey that needs to happen uh, during the process. You can either have a seller provide an existing survey and sign a legal form called a T-47 that the seller is basically saying that they believe this survey is valid and they supply that to the buyer or you may have buyer or seller purchase a new survey from a qualified surveyor who's going to come out and remeasure the ground and be sure everything's right. In our practice of real estate at Texas Pride Realty, we want to see a new survey every time. We do not want to have our seller sign a T47 taking legal responsibility for that survey and, and saying that we think this survey is valid because our sellers are not surveyors. We don't want our buyers inheriting that survey because if their seller is inaccurate, let's say something did was, was wrong with the survey, the buyer has to go find that seller to get any remedies ha to happen. Or they have to file against the title insurance company, which the title insurance company is going to say, well, we, we depended on the, the reliability of the seller in that T47. So our policy is always, always, always get a new survey. Always. But most title companies in their onboarding questionnaire, when they get a new contract, they send a questionnaire out to the buyer and seller, and they'll inevitably ask the, the, the seller, hey, do you have an existing survey? They end up renegotiating this paragraph of the contract that we put, the Texas Pride Realty has put in their new survey. We're protecting our clients, new survey. Title company will just in the process of of getting the questionnaires filled out, well, they'll ask, well, don't you have an existing survey? And they'll undo the protections. They will basically renegotiate this paragraph of a contract behind our backs. And sometimes we, as the agents, don't find out until we get to the closing table. And they slip across the existing survey to our buyer and say, well, here it is. And I'm like, no, we wanted new survey. We demanded in the contract new survey. Oh, well, we saved them, you know, a couple hundred bucks. In the purchase of a home, it's worth more than a couple hundred bucks to have this protection. So um, through talks today and yesterday with Republic Title, we had a situation where something wasn't going right. And this scenario happened where we had a seller that we were protecting by making the buyer get a new survey. And the seller received the, um, the, uh, the welcome document from Republic Title. And on that welcome document, it says, don't you have an existing survey? Would you just send it to us? And our seller thought they had to give it over. And I went off on them and our agent went off on them. And we, we said, stop renegotiating contracts behind our back. You're not supposed to be doing this. You would never renegotiate the sales date. You would never renegotiate the sales price. You wouldn't renegotiate repairs. I mean, why don't you put that in the survey to the, to the seller and say, didn't you really intend to get more money? Maybe we should just mark this up. That's totally not the role of title, but they will, they will renegotiate this on us. Anyway, long story short, Republic Title called today. They said, you know what? You're right. We apologize. We are changing our processes. We are going to change that form to take that off of there. We will execute the contract as written. Now, Republic is the leader in title companies in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. Republic is the preeminent title company. I want to see every other title company do the same thing. Stop renegotiating the survey behind our backs. Just stop trying to save $400 on a survey. Let's get people the best protection buying their home. Because that's really what we should be doing. Not, you know, uh, yeah, $400 is nice. But there are so many things that could go wrong. And I've had two or three transactions in my career since 2003 where the survey has been critical. And if we inherit existing survey, we don't know what we get. So anyway, I'll get off my high horse. Bob McCraney, Texas Pride Realty. I'm so proud of our agent who raised the issue. I'm so happy that, you know, by calling and, and, and writing Republic Title, we've gotten this change. And I'm very happy with Republic Title for listening and, and understanding our concern and changing their process because of it. Hopefully it will benefit a lot of buyers and sellers across the Metroplex. Take care. Bye-bye.